Hey, welcome back to my new video. This is Easy Tutorials, and for those of you who are the first time in this channel, please consider subscribing. Today we'll be creating this. Before we start, I'd like to invite you to support me on Patreon. You can also get access to all my premium content. So let's start. First, let's import the logo into After Effects. Create a new composition and name it, Glitch. I'm using the full HD 1080 pixels preset with 30 frames per second and 5 seconds long. Create a new solid. You can use any color you want, it does not matter. Go to Effects and Presets panel and search for, Fractal Noise. Apply it to your solid layer, and adjust its settings like this. Change Fractal Type to Turbulent Basic. Set Noise Type to Block. Open Transform Settings. Then click here to unselect Uniform Scaling. Then, change the width value to 1200 and the height to 75. Set contrast value to 185 and the brightness to minus 115. Now let's animate it, using expressions. Keep the shift key pressed, while clicking on the rotation stopwatch and write this expression. Wiggle open bracket 10 comma 15 close bracket click away with your mouse to save the expression open the evolution options then click here to enable the cycle keep the shift key pressed while clicking on the cycle stopwatch and write this expression time multiplied by 800 Your glitch animation should look like this. Go to the project panel, and create a new composition. Name it, Glitch Logo Animation. Drag your logo inside of it, then do the same with the glitch composition. Create a new adjustment layer and name it, Displacement. Go to Effects and Presets panel and search for, Displacement Map. Apply the effect to your displacement layer. Click here to make the glitch layer invisible. Then, change the displacement map layer to our glitch layer. Now if you change the max horizontal and max vertical values, the magic will happen and it looks like this. To create the real glitch effect do like this. Drag your displacement layer to 15 frames. Then click on edit, and split layer a few frames forward. Move the new displacement layer a few frames forward. And change these values to get a different glitch displacement. Split again the layer and repeat the process. You can do this, as many times you need, with different values, and of course different lengths. Be creative. Now, let's add color to some of the glitches. Create a new adjustment layer, and call it color. Go to Effects and Presets panel and search for, Colorama. Apply the effect to your color layer. You can change the color like this. Drag your color layer only over the displacement layer you want to be affected. And cut it like this. Repeat the action the same way you did with the displacement layers if you want. Let's check our final glitch animation. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to create this logo glitch animation in After Effects. 
Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and comment. It would be great to know your opinions about my tutorials. Also, you can make requests for new tutorials, about interesting effects or animations that you would like to learn. See you soon.